Welcome back. Ewok Templar. Cry of Fear. I had just got a single one of the fuses. I had been tearing into this mod with a, a ferocity like no other for some reason. It was made out of love. I don't know why I give it so much crap. But I, I feel like that's who I am now. The game's not perfect. I, ooh. I, <laughs> for some reason, I can't handle it. I don't know what's wrong with me. Sometimes I enjoy video games. I think it's because I'm getting older. I think just complaining about stuff sustains me. You know what I mean? I could backtrack that way. The trains won't hit me this time, right? Because they all flew down here already, right? Anyway, let's go get that other fuse. It's nice and neat. Remember where the where the shotgun is on that bus? We had to go back there and grab it too. I might as well grab it first and then move it back here so it's closer to us. I don't not like the way the shaders fra fractor like that, man. How the meshes turn to blackness. What would that be called? A light. Oh, it's a, like a lighting glitch, right? Because like. They don't actually turn black, they just get dark. So I guess it wouldn't be like the meshes. It's gotta be something with the lighting. Anywho, this is the only way, right? That, yeah, that door does nothing. Get a little more comfortable. I got rid of that key? Yeah, I got rid of that key. I'm gonna go grab the shotgun and bring it over here. Which it should be this way, right? Yeah, because that leads back. That's Weston. Weston, yeah, yeah, we did all that already. We went to Randall Land Road. Yeah, here it is. We did this one. We did this one first, actually. Right? Because this one goes all the way back. That one's we need to do next. Yeah. We need to do this one next. Because that's the easy one. Because that's the one I just got to go over there. Get into the subway. And, uh... What's it called? Get the fuse. Subway exits right here. Can never get comfortable with this side. I'm gonna bring it closer and lean a little bit back. There you go. Always feels like my left hand's overextended. For some reason. I haven't... I, I, I think it's because the way I set up my monitors. I changed the way they were just a little bit. Just enough to where now... It feels like my left hand is like turning in. It's it's not important. It's just a slight little irritation. It's just a little bit uncomfortable. If I just relax. Yeah, that's better. If I just relax. Let my chair do the work for me. I'll be fine. Let's bring this pump boy back here with the flare. It's gonna hang out with the flare now. Alright. You stay there. I really hope those things, that shotgun can one-shot the regular ones, like the Jason masks. If it can one-shot the Jason masks, then I'll be like, okay, it's okay. It's okay. But if it takes two pumps for a regular Jason dude, I might just get rid of that one. I'll, I'll feel bad. I'll feel bad only because I got rid of the sniper rifle and I can't, it disappeared last time I went back to where I left it. So I can't get it back. And the sniper was actually one-shotting the dudes in the bed. And the dudes in the bed take two shotgun shells. If, like, if you bear... Two to three if you barrel stuff it into their mouth face. And, like, four pistol rounds if you barrel stuff it in their chest. But the sniper was doing them in one shot. And that was nice. That was really nice. The sniper could also do the little dudes in one shot. So I was like, oh, this is good. actually good. This makes me happy. And now they introduce those weird tree beard dudes where they make no sound if you shoot them in the face, but they make an, a pain sound if you shoot them in the chest. So then you get confused whether or not you're actually damaging them if you shoot them in the head. Once they introduce those big tree dudes, I started like, they take a, like a clip at least from a weapon. Either a clip of pistol and some change or a clip of carbine and some change. Well, we got this. I wish both lights would work at the same time. If you notice, it looks like the... The camera light gets a little bit darker, like it's still there. You can still still see a little bit of white glow at the body of the screen, but it completely like I was hoping it would combine them. But that might be a technology problem, you know what I mean? I mean I mean there's multiple light sources. It's Half-Life 1. They could have 
He could have let me have two light sources like that. Right? If I do this, no, it won't let me. I kind of want, I want double light source. So alt fire is apparently punch, which I wish I knew that a long time ago. I would have stopped putting, putting my pistol away and grabbing the camera out. But anywho, I could go on. I could digress about controls, the, the fact that fuses are the same size as ladders. The fact that quest items can't just be like sucked up into a special inventory slot. No, you have to, you have to take up an inventory slot all on their own because science. I left a shovel there. At least that stayed. Right, guys? We still have a shovel that we can't use as a weapon, by the way, because it's too... It's not designed for that. There's never been a movie or video game ever that used a shovel successfully as a weapon. That's just... I can't stop. I don't know why. You can't stop giving this kid this mod that was made out of love for horror games in Half-Life 1. It's a pretty good mod. I can't stop giving it the business in, though. I can't stop. I don't know why. As soon as it started talking, I started pointing my gun at it and going, Hey, this isn't perfect. Cry me a river, sweet man. It saved my baton, of all things. This is kind of nifty. She's still dead. Can't, um, uh... Do anything with that. Didn't explain what actually happened to her. He just blamed, like, the ghost made it... The, the chain ghost in his, like, in his chair of pain. Hold on, where even was the fuse? I gotta find it now. I just realized. I remembered where it was last time, now I completely forgot. We wanna go this way. Yes, not that way, this way. That way leads me back to the park, where you first got the sniper rifle. But no good came of it. This way is where new enemies started spawning. We killed them all, and then we turned back around. You can actually climb over those pipes, so if you really wanted to backtrack all the way, you could. But I believe the other fuse is over here, right? Good thing it leaves all the doors unlocked. You're going to go find the key card again. Could you imagine? Wait, did I do this one already? Probably just because I went all the way over here, killed everything, and turned back. Because I was like, you know what, I'm going to do the other one first. Because it's more difficult. I forgot why I made that decision, but I did. I do remember making that decision. Right, I came all the way over here. Got the fuse. And then came back. After I killed everything. I think it's just because it was easier to do this, and I figured, you know what, I'd rather have a nice little stroll. There it is! On the ground where I left it. Now let's be careful, because maybe enemies spawn while you have it in your inventory? Maybe? No? It's just that easy. It's that easy being this breezy? I'm gonna go ahead and save. I don't trust it. This game has taught me anything. It's gonna do everything it can to bother me. <laughs> Next time I fight the chainsaw guy, not only is he not gonna kill me at all, he's just gonna take away one of my inventory slots. Like, he's gonna cut at me with the chainsaw. Like, last time when I fell into, like, that memory dream pit of evil, I don't even know what to, how to describe it. The Max Payne dream, basically. And I went down that super long hallway to have him talk about the doctors didn't listen to me, about my feelings and the, my bullshit. And the dude took a chainsaw swipe at you through the door. I was like, next time that happens, what if they just take away one of your inventory slots? Wouldn't that be something? Wouldn't that be on par with the BS? Now, by the way, mm, this belongs to us now. You can only carry five things now. Which, technically, you already only can carry five things because you can't drop the phone. That's right. There's an item in your inventory you can't drop. So, technically, this is a lie. You don't have six slots, you have five. Next time you only have four slots. 
four slots, big enough to hold ladders or four fuses. <laughs> you can, can you imagine a dude walking around with four ladders? What that would look like? That newspaper makes me think that it's a save point, because look how similar they look at first glance. They're even a similar size. They couldn't have made the newspapers a different size from the tape recorder. They even have like a 3D like shape to them, like they're bulging out of the ground so you, it catches your eye. And then like the lighting glitch happens, so then you think, oh, eh, it's not. It's not. It's not the same. Not too much. Who dropped tape recorders everywhere? Makes you think. I'm gonna go through this one or the other one. I think I went through this one last time, so I'm gonna do that. Keep it... Keep the continuity. Yeah, this is where I came in. Come over here. This is the side where she's not dead. But she could have if she wanted to. But she didn't. I don't even remember where I used that key. It was like a weird locked door that I wouldn't even have thought of. Remember that key I had for a long time? The Ronald Street key? And it just said Ronald Street? You had to use math to figure out where it went. Okay. Right? Because this is... Yes. I come here. This is the junction that connects the two. Then I come back over here. This is home. Yes. Good. Get in there, then. Go we'll talk to this dude. Only have six clips of the good juice. Not good. I wish I had more. I do have plenty of clips of the burst pistol, but the burst pistol I have mixed feelings by. Because like sometimes it kills the little ones in three, sometimes it doesn't. Sometimes it takes two shot. But the ghost lady, if the, if the ghost lady is a crawling ghost lady and she hits you in the ankles, that makes you miss all your shots. So you gotta time it just right. It's like super, uh, I don't even know how to describe it. I'm gonna save right now. I just, that's something I'll fuse to be placed. Oh, I wonder what to do then, huh? Weird how I know how to use doors instantly, but I gotta come in here and use the use function in order to shove that in there. You know, for the immersion. Anyhow. That door is unlocked now. Pick up the Remington 870. Save. And I guess we'll walk in here and see what happens. Oh boy. Please be nice. Please tell me I've beaten the game. I've received ending one, the good ending. Get on the escalator. We'll just write it down. Oh, good for me. Ah! On the plus side, that's another clip. Alright, enemies have been reintroduced. Which means we're going in the way of progress, which is both a good thing and a bad thing, because that means new puzzles, new bosses, new problems. God, it's hard to shoot him. What the? Did he shoot himself? Where did he even come from? Where? Oh, he's way down there. You got that one. Sniped in the dark, you punk. It looks like the track is closed off. All right. Aha! Damn it, horror games with the music. Yeah, okay. Bathrooms are canceled. That's fine. 
We don't need bathrooms where we're going. Do I want to ride the escalator? Nah. Then I won't be able to run away as effectively. All well, things are fine now. Oh, good. These accelerator ways are broken. God, you gotta hate long anythings, man. What is this? Why is it yellow back there? There's double doors back there. Does this explode at some point? Am I supposed to blow this up? Fire hose is definitely not an option. Damn, dude, seriously? What is this? No entry. Yet the gates aren't blocking it. Gotta be careful. The train to Norcastle is delayed due to a signal malfunction. Please stand well clear of the platform and the gates, as the next train is not for public use. The next train is not for public use, but I gotta use it. There's nothing else to do here, dude. Oh god, there's some sort of glitch happening. The matrix is collapsing over there. I was looking around for a save point just in case. You know. Did it lock me in here? No, I came from the bottom, that's right. I came from down there. Alright, I'll get on your train without saving. Oh, there it is, thank god. Bring both fuses from the blue line to escape with the what? But how? Wait, you're telling me I need to get the fuses again? I want my feet back. Who stole your feet, bro? Is that like one of the secrets? So I gotta put them in there? Are the fuses his feet? Why are they shipping stuff? Also, why is it why is it so cumbersome to get around this pole? Wait, so I I gotta put the fuses in there? Wonder what that can mean. Is it being serious? Bring both fuses from the blue line to escape with the train. Alright. So what do I do then? I have to walk all the way back there. And for what? Where do I put the fuses? If you want me to go get the fuses, then what gotta show me some like representation without science mathematicians. Like, what is going on? I need both the fuse Oh, you gotta be freaking kidding me. I gotta put them there. Do I have to dodge the train after I put them in? The dogs and the bees bark at me when I get the fuses. All right, go get the fuses. Go get the fuses. But you know what? I'm leaving my shotgun right here. Okay. Oh, should I drop them two things so I can pick them up two things on my way back? Instead, so I can just get them both at the same time? Ah, it's a risky move. Very risky. You know, hold on, how many clips of this I have? Because I know I have a lot. Yeah, not a lot. I have a lot of the repeating pistol. But, uh, I'm just, I'm worried I'm going to need it. It's so nice to have. How, how do I change firing? Is it Z? Okay, it is. Triple and single. Might as well leave it on triple. All right. Anyhow, let's just, let's get this over with. All right, there they are. Beautiful things. This is a mistake. I really hope not. I really hope a cutscene doesn't happen to where I can't come back and grab those. I'm gonna save just in case, because I'm not. I'm only doing that just because the 
the machine pistol's got more clips than that, and the shotgun, honestly, it's okay. It doesn't wow me. Also, I'd rather do this in one go. So we did a lot of fuse moving. I like how the first puzzle was move fuses. And then the second puzzle right after you fight five enemies is move those same two fuses again. Is this door going to explode at some point and the dude's going to start chasing me? Am I going to have to run down this, then run back and use it to stop him from getting to me? Like, what's with the yellow door, dude? Is it like a bonus, like a secret area? Like, if I if I found a grenade, could I go do the secret area? I just hit it real hard. You just keep on breathing, boyo. Yeah, that's fine, that's fine, yeah. Yeah, that's fine. That's good, that's nice, I like it. Alright, so the door is just permanently unlocked now, right? Alright, it said from the blue line. Is this not the blue line? I didn't realize I had to be a train station engineer to play a video game. This is, this is great. Where's the blue line? What is the blue line? Is this not the blue line? This is blue right there on the on those things. Does it mean from like over here? Is there like a wall? Like, okay. Here's some information. Ah, yes. What about this? Okay. So, where are, where are we? Where's the you are here button? Oh my god. This is how they try to build up tourism. I'm at Hanson Square. Okay. Hanson Square is a blue line. It's a blue and green line, it looks like. And insects with the red line over there. I'm going to the red line, I think. And I think I'm. This is the green line, I'm guessing. Maybe not, because I see a lot of blue everywhere. I need. What? I live in Kirkville, so I need to head there somehow. Somehow, in Kirkville. This train is blue. Does that make it the blue line? Are there two fuses way over here? Wait, let's look at this again. It's two double laned. Green line, blue line. Judging from the map and the way we've been moving, does that mean this is the green? And that's the blue. Why isn't it labeled more proper? Oh wait, here we go. This is red, and that one's green. So wh where the white devil are we actually? We're here in Hanson Square, yet somehow we're seeing the red and the green line, even though it's telling me the red line should be downstairs. So where's the blue line? Can't be here. Because this just leaves. This goes down this way. Is it the dark area that it was just that? Go back down. Is it here? Is this the blue line? They want to be nice, they want me to do the double fuse thing again, but were they nicer this time? And they're like, you know, let's we'll put it right next to it. Yeah, this is the blue line right here. Go 
by logical deduction. There's no fuses here, though. Is this also blue line? Yes, it is. But all these gates are closed. This is still Hanson Square, and this is the blue line. This is the blue line they want me to find. Yet this is not the fuses I need to use. Are there fuses on the wall? Why do I have to turn into freaking Nancy Drew in order to use a train? I'm, I'm about to look this up. This is stupid. This is dumb. This is terrible. <laughs> I dislike it a lot. I'm wandering around staring at train holes hoping for the best. Hold on, give me a second. Oh god, I don't know why I screwed forward. Hold on, let's just... Let's take a let's drop into the wild side of life. Okay. I can't grab them yet. Gotta go back to the train. All the way back there. Weird puzzles, man. I'm also going to change one other thing. I don't know how much it's going to affect anything. If anything at all. Oh, there they are. I was like, wait, where are my guns? Just because the guy said he this that he did this. I don't know. I don't think he even had that in his playthrough. The burst fire pistol. Sucks to be him. Looks like this door is actually open over here? No. No, it's not. So, somehow I missed it. There wasn't a good picture of where it was either. <laughs> that it was on the train. Any anyone, let me know if you see a sledgehammer in any of this. This simple, is it that pen, that pencil, those papers, these piece, these planks of wood? They're clearly not sledgehammers. See this thing that says I want my feet back. I don't get that one. Give him his feet back, dude. I don't know what he wants. Give him your shoes. Is the lamp supposed to be a sledgehammer? What the? Well, there's a health syringe, so it's not a total loss. That's almost a sledgehammer, right? Is that it? Is that the sledgehammer? That broken pole inside that train? I don't think that's a sledgehammer at all either. I also don't know why that singular pole is the only one that's broken. 
What? Was I on any other train? I wasn't on any other train, was I? I was on a bus. I don't see a sledgehammer down there either. Nothing. It would stick out. It would look like a sledgehammer. It'd be fairly long, kind of like the guns are. What? Is it in the roof? Let's stop and look this up again. Because I, I literally couldn't find a picture of it. To save my life. I'm going to look it up again. Okay, let's just save up here. Just in case. We've learned nothing. We're all out of ideas. Because this part's not even a puzzle part. This is just confusing. This is just built bad. This is slapping a, um, <laughs> a story together with sledgehammers and fuses. Oh, you can go through that Let's door, son of a blue bee sting. One. Oh, I see. Oh, it's going to be in there, isn't it? Way back there on the ground. Oh, yeah, the there it is. Yes. Okay, thank you. Can... Thank you, Slippery Jim. It might include you in the video and give you a thanks. Slippery Jim, everyone. Slippery is spelled with a one instead of an L. Slippery Jim. Slippery and Jim are capitalized. He did that 11 years ago. Hopefully he's still around, doing his thing. Let's go back. Can you believe it? Turns out I'm the jerk. Because I never would have thought, ever, and it would take it would have taken me hours to come over to this door and be like... You know what I mean? Because these doors are locked and it didn't look like anything was in here. So I'd have to use wizard magic to figure out... Oh, here we go. There it is. Oh, look. What's that? I couldn't even see that from out there because it's blocked off. See, you can't even get back there far enough to look. Can I go through this door? No. The door can't... Strange. The door can't be open now. Huh. <laughs> God, it moves slow. On the plus side, that guy was so shocked that I had a sledgehammer. <laughs> he He... Gave me two chances to send him to the Shadow Realm. Oh! Oh, good. I also saw... Oh, my God. There were iron sights this entire time. Did the, did the game tell me that? Did I use this in, like, the first episode and completely forgot about it? Hey. Can I... I, I probably can't shoot you through the glass, can I? Even though it is a soft, uh... Soft target. Oh. Hey. Man, I could have been corner shooting these guys and one tapping them this entire time. Is that window open? No, it's still there. Alright. Let's see when cheese this guy. Hey. Oh. On the plus side, I remember hitboxes are still a thing, so I figured if I bury it, it'll go through the glass and into his mouth. And it did. Which is good. I'm glad. Now it's simple, really. We'll save the game. Because some enemies probably responded. And we gotta go do a nightmare sequence again. Yay! <laughs> Ruining it for everyone. Telling the story. That's right, E.T. likes to make fun of mods that are years and years and years old. I like to complain about things so much. Oh my god. We calm down. The slowest swinging weapon. Oh god, what's happening to the frame rates over there? Looks good, looks good. Looks janky over here. Why does it look janky? I don't like that. Hold on.
What, what am I looking for? Five. What five things are you doing? Now it's only taking th th this much. Hello. Hello, McFly. Hello. None of the other recording sessions look that bad. Hold on. Let's... Okay. That's a lot better. I don't know why. Maybe it was just the observation screen. Alright, whatever. Looks good now. I was about to say, I will stop recording and I'll fix this right now. I'll have a ham sandwich. I'll take a salad. I'll take an hour break. I'll come back. I'll reload an old save. Oh, I can't reload an old save. Alright, so I should have made fun of that guy who made multiple saves, because he was smarter than me. Oh. Good. I almost make it to that door. <laughs> I can almost... I can make it. Alright, maybe I'm not supposed to go that way. All right, down the middle, definitely. No, I have to do parkour. Thank God for giving me a safe spot. <sighs> Thanks. This is gonna be a while. We might have to smash cut to when E.T. finally makes it. Oh my god, am I supposed to crouch jump? Oh, you... Mm, you old, old, old modded version of Half-Life, I swear to god. Yeah, that's what it was. You gotta be kidding me. Really? Okay, these are a little bit easier. Alright, definitely not the spiral uppercut path. Okay, obviously I gotta squeeze right here. No, 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 no! No, don't make me do anything ever again. I think going down's a trick. Can I climb, can I climb this? Oh my god. No! Oh god. You know what, just go down there. Obviously the game wants you to do it a certain way. Whoa, okay, I did that one for me, thank god. They recognized that that was, they did too much. Do I have to have the blur vision too? Mm, mm, oh, oh. Why? <sighs> I'll be strangely good at that from now on. At least the city looks nice out there. Oh no. 
This is where decisions come into play. My life served on a plate for all you to eat. I didn't know you were um, uh, you were a drowning pool fan. What's going on this? That fateful night, the child laid open, the road broken. Why do you have to walk that way so late, young man? Why did you have to be so foolish, delusioned, and embittered by his parents' words? The child was broken. Was, are these lyrics that I wrote in high school for my band that I called Anthem? Get at me. Not Anthem, sorry. I'm thinking about the video game. Doesn't matter. None of this matters. I think it was Nine Hammer. Something like that. Physically broken mentally, the men in white placed him in the rolling chairs. How he laughed. How he laughed. And so he lived what remained of his life. One day, fate smiled upon the child. And so he came upon the implement of his destruction. Decisions, decisions. The outcome hat was not certain. Pro Captu Lectoris. Oh, he's summoning, he's summoning the demons. He's using the wizard magic. He's, he's disgruntling the LGBT community. Uh, Habent <laughs> Sao Fada Labelli. My life. So that's all over. So that's all over. Doesn't change. All right, what's the decision? Handicap, car, gun. Car, right? Gun sounds like, yeah, I chose violence, right? Or does this mean, well, I don't even know what that means. I don't want to know. But car, does that mean I was in a car accident? Or this, I left? I drove away? Wanna run away, never say goodbye, that kind of style, right? Do I, have to, do I have to live through all of them? Car. Oh, book. Car, chair. You can still be handicapped if you want. What, what's the thing here? My life, laid broken, so late. Why did you have to walk that way so late, young man? Did you have to be foolish, delusioned, embittered, and broke? The child was broken physically, broken mentally. The men who placed him in the rolling chair. Now he laughed. How he laughed. He lived with what remained of his life. One day he found the child so came upon the implement of his destruction. Delusion, delusion. And the outcome was not certain. Do I have to make the decisions based on what my life was saying? Because like then it's like... The wheelchair does show up in the poem. But first... Why'd you have to walk so late? Faithful late upon the road. There's the road and the car broken. Why'd you have to walk so late, young man? What did you have to be so foolish, delusioned? That, 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 that's a quote for some reason. That part of why I had to walk so late, young man, is a quote. Is this a puzzle or am I literally choosing my fate? Oh, if I go back, it's into the gun. Go car. What happens to go book? Book, car, gun. Yeah, let's go back to car. I'm a book car man. Same room. What happens if I go double car? Same room. Okay, so you get trapped in. So it is a sequence you have to figure out. So I went car, wheelchair. Can't be book, right? Book's always going to be wrong. Because that's where I came from originally. You go back to book. Wheelchair. It looks it's the exact same room since it came in backwards. So I, I went car, wheelchair, which took me here, right? So gun. Okay, there's got to be an order in which I do that. I mean, going to gun makes me come out of car. 
All right. Okay, let's think about this. Wait, what, the book quote. When's that happen? Okay, so let's go. Car, book, chair, gun, right? Car, book, chair, gun. Oh, that one, right? Let's look at this poem again. My life served on a plate. Child upon the road car. Why are you so late, young man? So foolish. A quote. It has to be a book. Mentally book. Man placed him in a chair. How he laughed, how he laughed. He lived the remainder of his life. One day, smiled upon. He came upon the implement of his destruction. That has to be it, right? There's no other way to translate this. It has to be car. Book. Chair. Gun. Super confused. So what other could it be? Does it have to be backwards? What would that be? Gun chair book, book car? I'm gonna look it up and it's gonna piss me off, I just know it. I'm gonna look up the answer and the answer's not gonna make any sense compared to the poem. I'm gonna look up the explanation to the answer why it matched the poem that way, and I'm I'm just gonna take a salad. What nothing but cars. Here in my car. In cars. Boom 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 boom. Something something. Super big salad, make me a sandwich, and give it to me in my car. Doodle needle. Come on. All right, safe to say, that's not the solution either. All right. That faithful night, the child laid open on the road, broken. Why are you so late? Published. Is it a sequence? Is it one for each line? Is it car, book, book, chair, 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 gun, gun, gun? I don't know. That doesn't make sense. All right, I'm just gonna look this up too. This is stupid. But it's I'm supposed to be focusing on the story part. Story of my life is how it ends. I don't. Right? Came implement. Oh, actually, no. No, that doesn't make sense. He lived what remained of his life. One day, fate smiled upon the child. Implement of his destruction. That's a gun. And then, like, a little Latin quote. And then it starts all over with my life. I don't think the word story is ever mentioned. This is stupid. Anywho, for some reason, it is... Car, chair, gun story. Car, car, chair, gun, book. We go car, chair, gun, 
book. Oh, so if you just go car first and go straight forward the entire time, you get there. Book being last doesn't make sense to me. Like, that actually does upset me. At first it made sense for a split second, but that's because I thought he said, like, story of my life. Right? Was, uh, my brain was just misremembering and adding that to the poem, even though it never was part of it. Okay, so, gotta move forward. Whip whip, tongue's here, he's having a good time. Okay. So you can't go 100% that way. Oh man, I see what happened. I stuck on. Set me free. I see how the puzzle operates. I'm going to activate him. We'll follow him for a while, and then we'll just book it. Because as soon as he goes around that corner, way over yonder, that's when things get all banana sandwich. We have to outrun this guy over here. We'll go this way. Go this way. Go this way, go this way. Go this way. Way over here on the other side. Making it downtown. This way, this way. This way. We're behind this guy. What's this? The exit, you are here. Okay, so we're gonna go down and go around that corner. Oh, god dang it. Bet the world isn't saving while this is happening either. Oh, come on. All right, now we know, though. We gotta go all the way to the left and make our way to the back. I didn't even get that close. Come on, let me cut the corners a little bit. All right, come on. One more time for your mom, mamma jamma slam jams. Okay. Oh god. Oh, oh, oh. All right, we're behind this guy. We're okay. <laughs> These whippy tongue boys are no match for my intellect. Although he is headed right where I need to be, I think. Wait. Did I end up in the exact same spot again? How? Yeah, that guy's coming. I gotta keep moving. Oh, come on. Oh, crap. I should've gone down the other hallway. This one just wraps around. Oh, no. <laughs> no, Lupus Tank. Oh, come on, dude. Puzzles in my Half Life's mod sandwich. You know what? Screw it. We do this part real fast. We're wearing gold plated diapers. This guy's coming around this corner, right? Go up this way. Yeah. I'm doing it. I'm beginning to believe. Oh, crap. All right, I'm here. I'm here again. I know where I'm at. Just follow this guy for a little while. No. Behind this dude. Follow him. Actually, no. That's the wrong way. This way. Crap. That might have been the wrong way. Yeah, I think this is the wrong way. Let's go. I was supposed to go this way. Two doors, wrong doors. Crap. 
Just going a big circle. I'm stuck in a corner somewhere. I know it. Yeah, let's quickly look at this. We gotta go back where we came from. It's all the way this way. I didn't see it though. Oh. Yes, he suffered severe spinal damage in the accident. It's a miracle. He became a wheelchair boy. Upper body motion. From the waist down, however, there is no nervous response at all. Not to mention the mental trauma he suffered. From what I can tell, Simon is a deeply disturbed individual. He has been on medication for years. Prior to the accident. Uh. Uh. No. Run for the door. You gotta make it, Simon. Holy fuck! But Simon, you've been using using your legs this entire time. Oh great, he has fingerless gloves. I didn't notice that until now. He's gonna have to go burn one soon. Is he still there? What the fuck? Wasn't this where I? No, 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 something is obviously not right. You think it's the drugs? I should hurry now. Before something else happens. You should. Leaving this one. Oh god. That's not fair. Alright. Well, if you're gonna do it for me, but really close to me. Does it like hurt me if they do it really close to me or something? Cool. Been trained, Boreo. Oh, I see. Let me just um uh, fix that for you. There you go. Alright, so now if I go back to this door, this is where I have to take the fuses, right? Yeah, I take the fuses this way. Man, that nightmare sequence was all kinds of things. But in my defense, book being the last one doesn't make sense to me at all, okay? So you have to do that first. The tape recorder's gone. Now you can take these fuses for some reason. That's not explained to you. We mean inventory full of that. Oh, I forgot about the hammer. Drop. Bye, hammer. You did your job. Now I'm leaving. Now I gotta go back to the nightmare door. Because I can't go through that door anymore. That door's broken. This is now open, though. Over here, see that? Was this always open? I don't think this was. Because I think we used to go down that way? No, maybe it was always open. Yeah, because that's the way I go back to over there. Nice, right, so come on. Not a nightmare dungeon no more. Just a really long, creepy hallway. Oh, good. Down. My favorite. Into the dark. Why not? Very long ladder. Just to add, all right, it's already on. I'm gonna say, let's add the illumination. Where's this go? There's a gun here. Is an enemy here? There's health here. Oh, my medkits are full. Well, seeing as we're in the end game, might as well keep it full up, am I right? <laughs> the juice. Thank you.
Years of normal video games have taught me to look for things like that. And here's the yellow door. Check it out. Man, that would have been a lot nicer and easier if I didn't have those crazy, whacked out, schizo -y nightmares, right? Am I right, guys? Really makes you think. You respawn suicide boys in here? Which, I like the music, but... I don't want them running up to me and giving me the shooty bang bangs every single time they have a feeling. Right, let's go ahead and save, because I'm gonna pick... You better believe I'm picking up both of my guns when I'm leaving here. I don't want to meet this dude who's looking for his missing feet. He's probably crawling around here. Okay, it's just the escalator. I could place a fuse in here <laughs> if I was cool. Now am I going to have to run? Anger. Anger began to boil inside the demon. Alright, so now he's going to do a little bit of a... Uh, my life in a box for all of you to eat kind of shindig. And we'll see how he feels after. I literally figured all the other three parts out. I just got confused because the quote was like right after the beginning with the car. Like that quote. I'm like, hmm, foolish child. But I guess I was supposed to surmise that this was the story of his life. Sitting here like a fool. At the end. Feels like it was just a few seconds ago I was traveling here. No, think straight. I got hit by a car, woke up. And these things have been trying to kill me since. Probably I mean, because you've been on a killer what rampage. What is actually happening with me? Mom keeps telling me to get home, but why? How would that solve any of the crazy shit I've seen? I can't even contact the police here. Everything is just fucked. You got three Could guns for free. I'm just hallucinating. No, s seriously. Am I? Probably. Or is there something else? It'll be real messed up if you're hallucinating so bad that you I actually pushed that lady off the roof. Doctor guy. Well, he is crazy, all right. But could he have done something to me? Seeing as he wears a gas mask. Or is all this just not real? I don't know, Samuel. I'm just very. Confused. Me too. I've been confused this entire so gameplay. Questions, but no answers. Not a single one. I'll see what happens when I come home. Huh? So I pick out my gun. Right. It was raining that faithful train night. I wonder if it's that dude looking for his feet. I just step out here <laughs> and still go the way where the sounds came from. Who wants some? I got a sandwich. Can I enter it like that? Can I enter that Amy down the sights? Oh, I can jump off the train? Glad I one shot of that guy. Who's next? Where are you coming from? Left or right? Aha! Come on, then. Show yourselves. Can I reload this normally? No loose shells? Yeah, that's nice. That feels good. That feels good. Made me feel like a big man down there. Who else is in here? No, I don't think so. I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think so. No. I got braces for you. Dental plan right here. Get your car insurance right here. Got your entire bag full. Come on. Let me see it. 
Missy at Captain Kapow. I like that it's getting more well lit over here. Oh, spoke too soon. The darker than a red ass now. Alright, I want to be able to shoot you guys and see you at the same time, so let's do this. Come on, then. Ooh. Is it time to start unloading on some B words? There's a problem. I can't see not a dang thing. That's a, it's my number one. I'll be fine. All right, come on. Where are you? We hiding. It better be well lit in here. I swear. I can see you again. Guess what? Big gun's out. What do you want? Where are you? Oh crap. Hold on, let me reload. Go back single shot. Alright, come on then. <laughs> We're having fun now, aren't we, boys? You're in your Jason mask and your hammers are no match for a man with a gun. I pulled out my gun. No. Sorry, we got another door back here. Uh, let's do it. Come on, let me loose. I'm clearing this train out. It's a foot. It's the feet the guy wants back. Oh, God. God. Ah, you missed. Ah, you got me that time. Yeah. Aha. <laughs> Inventory. Aw, oh, you gotta be joking, dude. You gotta be goofing me. No, don't make me do this, man. Not like this. I gotta... <sighs> Hold on. I'm gonna bring them back here. And go all the way back. Because I'm assuming each foot is by itself. Right? So that tells me if I jump off the train, that's the bad ending, right? Also, I need to make sure I didn't leave the first foot by being too excited and walking right past it. This, is, this has been a minute. This has been a minute of going down like the Doom Slayer. A little bit more well lit. A little bit more finger poppery. I didn't see a foot though. See the feet. I'm back here. Yeah, I'm back here. Here it is, Footsville. As I live and breathe. All right, right here. I leave you my triple burst pistol. Then right here, I leave you my shot gun. -o. Okay. There they are, existing and beautiful. Save. Let's see how these are the puzzles I get. I can gather feet just fine. Didn't explain why there's this part right here where you can just like jump off the train for some reason. I wonder if that's how you unlock chapter 7. Maybe I'll make a separate save and we'll just jump off with all our guns. See if the rampage can continue. You didn't see a foot, did you? Right? Okay. God bless it. I prefer it when the, when the holes are broken. 
kind of just in my way right now. So what's up with this train car? What all oh, is a wheelchair car? That's why. Gotta have more space. More space for the base. Uh, all right. So that's one foot. You got the foot. But he said feet. He didn't say return my. Oh. Did it say give me back my foot? I kind of sorry. He said give me back my feet. House is clean, right? House is clean. House is clean. Give it a real. Man, this train is long. <laughs> Man, there's a lot of city for us to drive through. Pouring <laughs> down like all the angels of heaven decide to take a science at the same time. Right. What if? All right, separate save time, separate save time. Smart play, smart play, smart play, because I'm curious. I want to come back here and see what happens when I jump off the train. Right here, number five. Train, train, yeah, yeah, I like it, I like it, okay. Now, real quick, and just in case, and just because we haven't used it a lot, get this up. Alright, so come here, I want my feet back. See, that's the thing. I just got... I must be crazy for carrying this around. The train's derailed. Save. I gotta go find my bag. Oh no, everything is gone. I got a parkour in my bag. I'm supposed to go under it. Okay, just keep on falling down. That's weird. That's nice. <sighs> what am I supposed to do? I can't crawl under. It looks like I'm supposed to, but I can't. here now. Okay, how hard is it to make a jumpy platformy game? Oh my god, I'm gonna have to cross jump over it. Well let me get all my stamina back. I think for these parts, I should have given you all the stamina you wanted. This really slows down the pacing. I get it being limited for the boss fights and the puzzly parts. Like the other, like, runny puzzly parts, like the chainsaw and the, the dream sequence, but these parts... Where it's literally, literally parkour. Parkour science. There you go. Finally did it. Oh, of course. Yeah, that was a good time to lag. 
Oh god, am I being timed now? Well, son of a bitch. never gonna end in my favor, man. Oh god. The music isn't helping at all. Well, I can't go home that way. Find a way out of the forest. Literally have no weapon. I'm assuming I follow the lights. Probably should grab one of those lanterns. Better than nothing, I guess. Really? <laughs> Good. Where was my bag? There's a car here. Oh good. The interior destroyed. There's nothing useful. Nothing at all. This is the game now. Couldn't have kept my bag attached to me more comfortably. My super duper bag that somehow held five guns. Wow, worst lantern ever conceived. There was a door in the forest that led to more forest. <laughs> I'll grab extra lanterns, why not? Oh, I can't. Okay, that's why. With the weird humming. There's a wall here. Another light source way over there. Can't tell if that's where I came from, though, you know what I mean? Oh, good. Take everything we've learned so far from the game. I can't get up there. What? Hey, wait. Oh, I have to crouch jump, don't I? The weird... The weird sprinting crouch. Okay, no, it just knocks you down. That's good. That's nice. Well, that's not where you go. That becomes an unstoppable fortress of forest. Like, that makes sense, right? Oh, now it works for some reason. Just mysteriously. All the other times, no. This time, yes. Well, there's a little door here. One of those famous forest doors. I already met one of them. Ain't no big deal. I don't even know where this light source is. A good view of the city from here. We're sort of inches together over here. Here's another lantern. Where do we go from here? The door's broken. Wall's broken right here. We go through. 
Take a look around. Uh huh, the wall we appears here. Do I want to get on the wall? What's going on? And there's this wall here. Oh, there's a door here. Kind of looks more like more wall. No, oh, here's a safe spot. Crash train. In the woods with the lantern. There's a path here. No, come on. Can't be serious. What is that? A doorknob. Oh god. Oh, come on. Ah. Son of a... What's the point of having the stick? Is the stick the only thing I can kill him with? It's made of wood. You think it's gonna do something? It's an arrow that way for the doorknob. Oh, come on, he appears there. Ah. You know what, I'm done. I'm done with this game. All right. I'm done, I'm looking it up. <laughs> I've completely given up, I've completely lost hope in whatever this mod was trying to do. All right. It's not the best, but it'll have to do. Where is it? There he is. Has to load him in. <laughs> no save point. Is that a note. Of the stick. Okay. I guess I'm gonna have to deal with her in a little bit. Did I keep my other super jump? I don't think I did. Which is fine. <laughs> Give me a lot of sticks. Oh! What a mean lady. Oh, I see. Why is it slotted to both? Go ahead and just... Ah, yes. Completely get rid of it. That's nice. I can't have two sticks? You give me a lot of sticks for someone who can only have two sticks. Did you think I'd accidentally make it to this point without it? Back into the woods. Oh, man. I swear to God. All right.
Oh, well, good. I'll fight you because I can kill you. That other jack wagon, though, he can get the business, man. He can get the super jumps for all I care. Night, night, lady. What are we getting here? Gotta be careful with my jumps. Gotta get lost in the wilderness. Ooh, what is this? He got the scissors blade left half. Is that a weapon that I can wield? Not enough to cut the rope with. Could use the other part. I'm gonna, to, I'm gonna have to put my stick down in order to pick it up in order to combine it with the other scissor half don't worry there's sticks everywhere otherwise otherwise I'll have to punch to drop me if I had something anything sharp I can cut this rope Okay, so I have to wander the wilderness looking for another half of a scissors. Good luck with that, right? Was it in the same house? Was one half over here and the other half was over there? Because you think if you broke a pair of scissors, you'd try to keep both halves together. No, of course not. Why, why would you? Why would you? No. After a bit, I start sawing it in half using my expertise. This is the house I jumped out of. So it's fine if I leave it alone. The woods sort of end over here. That's another building way over here, but is this the building I'm trying to get in? No, this is a different building. Oh good. Other scissors half. Get off me. Breathe on someone else. I want your coffee breath. I don't know why I assume she had coffee breath, but I assume she does. You're hanging out in a very big room. My inventory is full. I can't even pick that health kit up. I'd have to juggle things too. I'd have to put my stick down. Or put, uh, put down the scissor half before I find the other scissor half. Hello? Don't you hide from me. There's the other half of the scissor. Inventory full. <laughs> well, ain't that something. If I put my lantern down, does it still light up the area? Okay, good. Look at this look at this big boy science I have to do. Ah Ah, oh, two doesn't do anything anymore. I forgot. Didn't think this through. <laughs> okay, that's how you do it. A slight little adaptation to the game. Huh. Get slam jammed. Slam and welcome to the jam, sister. <laughs> the low gravity. Alright, let's jump over this building, shall we? No, we can't. Won't let us. It's too much building for us. Oh, is that the... Okay, it is. This is my secret cap. I'm always unhappy. <laughs> Oh, 
Alright. Did I do good? Watch out for the trees. Why? What did the trees do? Oh, this is a long one. This might as well be my finale episode though, right? Jesus! So they're just gonna jump scare me to death now, huh? <laughs> Come on! Get... Stupid trees. What am I supposed to do? <laughs> okay. Okay, really? Seriously? Get out of my way! Do I have to use the scissors on her? No, I don't have the scissors anymore. So you're just in my way. This was nothing. You told me to come this way and it's nothing. That tree's gonna still leap scream at me. And my jump is normal. For now, I could activate it though. Okay. What does that mean? Oh god. It's another nightmare sequence, huh? that to slow you down. Okay, let me go ahead and activate slow, slow gravity. Just in case I goof off. Kind of tells me I don't want to be on them when they open. the little gravity working for me. That's right. That's right. Science man. Crap, am I supposed to fall down one of them? the trees. Here we go. <coughs> the trees jump down and scream at you. Okay, yeah, that's good. That's nice. And they hurt you. That's out the door. There it is. I'll probably able to get a save. Gotta handle this door business now. <laughs> Doors will kill you, by the way. We'll do all this crawling. Is there a no clip one? That'd make it easier. <laughs> Just trying to weasel my way through this now at this point. Tired of it. Just 
last door, right? No, it's this one. This one's the last door. Actually, no, it's not. It's not the wrong way. Well, I'm in here now. How fast do you slam open? Not very fast. Okay. You're a slow one. I don't know how a door is slamming. Well, make a big deal about it, why don't you? Jesus. I don't know what this game wants, but I do know I don't want it. Another lantern, just in case you lost your lantern. God, I'm running low on health now, too, because that thing slapped me so well, apparently. So this is ambiently more pleasing already. It's walled off. Not a health, not a save point. A healthy save point. <laughs> I have the dodge lightning now. This has become lethal company. It's the doctor. Please, a save point, some drugs, something, a backpack, a gun. <sighs> oh, he's got graffiti on his house, that's not good. Two picnic tables, that's pretty nice though. Where's your barbecue? Where's your grill? This is gonna be an old, whole another hallway of terror and horror. Because if it is, this has already been two hours. Like, if this is gonna be a whole other thing, I like give this like chapter seven. Oh, good. I'm tempted to cut it right here, then see if, like, if the ending is just right around the corner, I'll add to it. I'll add on to this episode, but if it's not, if it's not, I'm gonna leave this one here, because this, this went on for a while. I thought this was gonna be the end. It doesn't feel like the end. It feels like I'm starting another chapter now. So I'm gonna go ahead and do a cut right here. If, if it's not, immediately after this cut, the rest of this episode will play, so ignore it. But if it's if it's not, then here's the cut for this one. And you'll find out next episode how long it was from here to the end. But thank you all. I'm gonna do a little cut right here. Hopefully you all enjoyed. You walk Templar going through cry of fear. So frustrated with right <laughs> with it right now. I'm literally cheating my way past past the um uh, past the chainsaw guy. Because screw him. He doesn't make the rules for me, alright? Not if not if there's rules I can break to get past invulnerable chainsaw men while all I have is a stick that I'm going to take every avenue that I can. But thank you all. Please like, comment, subscribe. Hit that like button. Keep on posting. I'll see you on the next episode. Y'all take it easy. God, it moves slow. On the plus side, that guy was so shocked that I had a sledgehammer. <laughs> he, he gave me two chances to send him to the Shadow Realm. Oh! Oh, good. I also saw, oh my god, there were iron sights this entire time. Did the, did the game tell me that? Did I use this in like the first episode and completely forgot about it?